After opening your system.io dashboard, then click on blogs. Now click on create. Now here write down your blog name. So I'll just write down here final analyst. And this is the blog URL, blog pad. So here I will just write down here blog. And you can see your domain from here. And now from here choose one of the templates you wanted to choose. Here you can see lots of templates. So I'm going to select this one. You can see the preview on here. So this is the complete blog website. Okay. And here you will get uh, four pages. This is the article pages. This is the contact page and then this is the about page. We can customize all of the pages very easily. So I will uh, select this template. If you didn't like this template, then you can see uh, more templates and you can choose by your own and then click save. So our blog has been created. If we see, let's view it first. So this is the blog we have just created in just a second. Now we want to write down our own blog post. We want to customize each and everything by our own. So click on here. So here you can see uh, blog layout, view blog and blog setting. If you click on blog setting, then you can ch change your blog language, blog URL and blog name. And if you click on view blogs, then you will see the blogs and blog layout. Let me click on here. So by clicking on here, we can uh, change our header and footer, but we cannot change the blog content over here. We will, uh, I will show you uh, how can you change the blog content in just a few minutes later. First of all, let's change our logo. So click the image here. And then from here, upload your logo. So I already uploaded my logo here. So I will just select the logo and click on insert. So the logo has been so big. So I will just make the size a little bit smaller. I will make it 60%. So if we sit on full screen mode, then yes, the logo is fine. Click the logo. And when someone uh, click the logo, then they should, uh, they should uh, visit this URL, panelanalyst.com. You can enter your system, uh, your blog website URL and here all of the pages. So this is the menu. So for, for now, I will just change the menu. So here you can uh, delete, add, you can do everything. If you need to add another menu, then click on here, add menu, and then write down the menu name. So let, let me resources, resources. And here custom link, you can add the, uh, add the page link over here. That's very simple. And if you want to delete this uh, menu, then just click the delete icon and it will be deleted. Okay, so that's very simple. Now let's change the footer. Here we also need to change our logo. So click on here and I will just upload the logo. So make the logo size into 60 pixels. Now we need to change our social media links. So I'll click on here and I will add my YouTube link. And I don't need this uh, Vimeo, so I will just delete this one. And I will drag this one over here. And it's done, Twitter. So for Twitter, I will let me copy the Twitter link. Okay, let me go to my profile and I will just copy the Twitter link and I will paste over here and it's done. So our header and footer is pretty done, pretty done. Now click on save changes and click on exit. And now here we can see the post layouts. Let's click on here. And this is the post layout. Okay. So we don't need to do anything over here. We can change our font and we can change the thumbnail size over here, but it's not required. So click over back. And here you can see post pages categories. If you need to add new post, then you can uh, create post over here. And if, if you need to create a new page, like uh, in our websites, let me show you. Here we have four pages. So if we need to add another page, then just click over here and create a new page. And categories. We can create multiple categories uh, depending on our blog post. So first of all, let's edit those posts. Okay. So this is the post. If you need to change the uh, edit the post, then just click over here and here you can edit the post content. Here you will upload, okay, the post title, category and the post image, you cannot change over here. For changing this, just click here and then click setting. And then here you can change the blog title. So let me, I will visit my official website. Now here, let me copy a sample. Let me open this blog, blog post and I will just copy the blog post URL. So this is the blog post title. I will uh, come over here and this is the blog post title and description. So I will just paste the uh, title over here and this is the permalinks. So I'll just write down here system IO pricing plans and then the blog post display date. It's not required and if you want then you can choose the current date and click on approve. And this is the blog uh, thumbnail image. You can change uh, change this. Just click over here or delete this one first and then choose your image. So for now, let's, uh, okay, it's not required right now. Let's make the default one. And here you can see all of the categories. So this uh, blog post is not on category two, category three. So first of all, click on save. So let's click on categories and 
let's edit those category setting this is not category let's make it general or make it tutorial tuto okay let's make it general this is a general knowledge post so SEO title make it general and SEO description you can write down our short descriptions about the uh, category let's click on set now click on uh, post and click over here and click on setting and then from here choose the category to general and click done and now click on here and here you can change all of those content okay so first of all i will just delete this one also let's delete this one delete this one and delete this so i will just copy the content copy some little content over here but you can write down your content on system.io platform so i will just copy this one this much content and then come over here and then double click over here press ctrl a then ctrl v and our content will be pasted over here and that's it so if you need to add an image over here then how can you do that just drag the image element over here and just upload your image over here this is very simple this way you can add the image if you need to decrease the size then you can decrease the size if you need to change the alignment you can change the alignment over here so this way you can edit your post now click on save changes and our post has been changed and here you can see the author so click over here and now i will upload the image of our website uh, 100 percent yes from here display image uh, fill 100 percent with then the logo will be shot properly or we can make it center then it will on the center and then change the name of your so the author name is funnel analyst Anna. and then your subtext we help you to make your final creation very easy using system.io now click on save changes and yeah it's done now click on exit so if we see the blog post then click on here then click on view so see the title has been changed we didn't uh, change the uh, change the thumbnail image and all of the things has been changed but here you can see here uh, another name over here uh, here here it needs to add this text but here we can see another text so how can you change this one so come over here click the block again and then click on setting from here you can see the title this is the title just replace the title by this one and for seo related things you can uh, add your descriptions add your keywords for adding keywords you can you can add keywords like this way like system.io this is a keyword system.io and after adding one keyword uh, add add a comma then pricing plans this is a keyword and then system.io pricing plan this way you can add keywords and author name final analyst and social image you can add an image uh, for social uh, social media and if you want to show the image on uh, google search engines then uh, you can detect uh, this one and if you want to hide the image from the search engines then you can uh, tick mark this one that's very simple so i will just uh, untick this one and now click save changes and if you reload this page then see the text has been changed so you will learn how to edit a blog post completely and now let's visit our blog first view blog and see this is a, a complete blog and here we don't have our blog so we need to change this one this is a home page okay so for uh, we need to click on pages this is the home page you can see this is a home page and it build its user templates that's why those are demo content just click over here and then click edit so now we need to delete those everything okay or you can change the image and change the uh, text and then add the uh, add the blog post url but i will not recommend that i will recommend you to delete each and everything i will just let's delete everything from here delete all of the content and we will use this one but here we need to change the placeholder text into a little bit black and then the border color let's make it pure black five pixel let's make it into two pixel and let's see it on full screen mode yes that's now fine now we need to uh, redesign it so from here just drag the section over here drag the section over here okay you need to drag over here and this is the sections now from here just uh, click the blog post listing drag the element over here and then click on the image and from here choose this one this uh, blog uh, listing layout choose this layout and then it will add it on here and now you can customize everything so for now i will just use the border radius into 10 pixel or i can make it 8 pixel then see the border has been added 8 pixel radius and scroll down below and here we need to add also 8 pixel radius then see uh, the radius has been added on the on the 
on here also and this is a margin we don't need to add any margins so if you save the changes and if you come over here the home page and if you reload the page then see the blog post has been added here you can uh, in here it shows all of the demo content okay but if you come to if you sit on live then you will see our real content so this way we will customize our others post so come over here click on post and now let's edit this post so just click on here click on setting first of all let's open our another blog post from our website copy the blog post and come over here uh, paste the blog post title and you can change all of the things I showed you in earlier and now scroll down below and you can paste your blog post content or you can write down your content over here like this way blog is best for all in one marketing so you can add these ones if you need to uh, bold this text then select the text and click on this b icon and this way you can customize in each and everything okay you can write your complete blog post over here and then just uh, uh, change this one so from here change the image of your logo i will just upload my logo and then from here repeat to full center okay not this one a uh, full hundred percent width and then uh, from here click center then it will add it on center then just change the author name into your name then i will just add the subtext we help you to build your sales funnel in a very easy way now click on save changes now click on exit and now we need to change the blog title so for changing it click over here and click setting and then add the blog post title and then add the permalink so permalink in system.io you cannot add dot okay you need to add dashes on the permalink versus click funnels you don't need to add a free text on your title just add the main keywords and from here choose the date click on apply and it's also going on a category or it will go on system.io so first of all let's create a category click on here and let's uh, edit this category click on settings and this one is system.io just use this one click on save and then click on again post and now click over here click setting and from here change this system.io category then click on save and now if we come to our home page then reload then see this title will be changed see the blog post title has been changed now if you if someone click on here then see our complete blog post that's very simple and when someone click on here home then they will redirect to the home page so let's say if you need to add a new post how can you add a new post click over here create and then you can add this i will show you in the next one next video because this video is becoming so longer and now for changing pages i showed you how to change the uh, home page this way you can change all of the pages just click over here and click on edit and you can change the page okay and this is the uh, post list paste so we don't need to change this one if you need to change then you can change the page and then contact page click the contact page and from here you can change you can change the background color click the click the click the sections and then you can see the color let's change the color into little black and make the width small two pixel and click over here and we will do the same thing over here make the color into black and the width is two pixel and placeholder text we will change the placeholder text into black click over here and from your placeholder text change the text into black and here the subject this text so here the color into let's make it black yeah that's it so these way you can customize each and everything if you need to add another thing okay if you need to add another thing then you can see all of the element over here if you need to add a button over here uh, let's say you need to add a button on here just drag the button element over here and then you can customize each and everything and then click the button and change all of the things over here this way you can easily customize each and everything so now your task is to uh, your task is to uh, redesign these pages by your own content that's very simple that's why i'm not showing you and then categories and in the next video i will show you if you need to add a new page new page or new poster then how can you do that very easily i will show you in the next video because this video has become so longer so i hope uh, let me show you our final blog click over here and this is our blog we make it very simple and here we have a newsletter option so when someone click his enter his gmail address then the gmail address will be added on our lead section and that's it for this particular video i will meet you in the next one thank you for watching